<laughs> I will compose the greatest sonata with your corpse. There was once a tale going around the land of Don about a musician. No one knew where he came from or where he was headed. Everyone just called him, the vagrant poet, Granger. Granger was orphaned during the war between the Monian Empire and the Southern Monsters. He was picked up by the Imperial Army, and then sent to the Monastery of Light. Similar to all orphans, Granger was silent and isolated. He never showed much feelings through his cold eyes. However, since a young age, Granger greatly enjoyed music and only when the melody of violins emerged from the monastery would Granger show any interest. During their growth, every orphan in the monastery has two options, to be a demon hunter or be a servant of the monastery. Granger chose guns and violins at the same time. He abhorred war and demons, to which he lost his family and home, thus he wouldn't hesitate to be a hunter. Violins however, meant a lot to him as they soothed his misery and nightmares. Much to everyone's surprise. Granger was in fact, tone deaf. Since he received his violin, Granger played lousy music wherever he went. The noise from the violins would be so bad that his opponents would lose focus. Granger would take this opportunity to shoot his enemies with his gun before they could realize it was a trap. He could instantly turn a beautiful piece of music into a battle song, and the ups and downs of melody often made him excited. Soon after, he took the lead among the demon hunters. Even the S-level tasks were not a big deal to him. Alucard, one of the most well-known demon hunters, admired and respected Granger. He remains one of the most fiercest gunrunners in the Monastery of Light, with great combat techniques and a strong, advanced sense of avoiding danger. In order to pursue the pleasure of killing demons and completing tasks quickly, Granger would often give the most fatal attacks to his enemies. When all six bullets of his magazine hits the target, the fallen enemy would feel the horror of Granger's guns, before realizing their life slip away. The news about Granger soon spread among the demons. As long as they heard a horribly sad melody, they would escape with haste, otherwise, it would not end well for them. After all, a painful death awaited. 